Previously on Official Small Tribes I've said it before, you always want to start your day off with a win and today was no different. Grabbing this 92 armor ascended Stego Saddle Blueprint which allowed us to raid one of the three bases we had raided in one day. Due to the defenses it wasn't much of a challenge but rather a steamroll. We began with the appetizers to which it was basic farm resources, so next was the main course. Of course, cryotames, advanced farm loot, to which we could reinvest straight back into our hidden base. And if I told you our luck had ended there, well my dear friend, I'd be lying. So what you're saying is, your luck continued. Well yes, over at the Red Obelisk were two players, boasting one of the most overpowered or even broken tames known as the mana, Karma. Their gear wasn't anything special, so a counter was most certainly on the rise. I struck at the perfect time and acquired both of their top tier dinosaurs. So I thought to myself, surely my luck was to end here. But this guy, he told me otherwise. He was going to lead us to the riches, the jackpot. But not yet. As of now, we weren't on the best of terms. No, I'm sorry, David. Come back, interrupt. Come back, interrupt. Okay, here we go. Nice. No, no, do not attack, trap. Come back in trap. There we go. Okay, look at me, brother. Look at me. There we go. Ah, okay, okay. No, no, no. Yeah, ah, ah. No, me. Okay, I'm just gonna have to start knocking this thing out. Oh, this thing's gonna break it. Okay, no, I'm just gonna freestyle this. No, he's just. He's trying to take out my whole trap. And then he's coming for me. Yeah, my trap didn't work too well. We were gonna have to freestyle this. Or we'll do it the old school way. Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. You should see these shots. Maybe now he's actually scared. Yeah, now he's running, running. Get your ass over here, boy. He's bloody. Please, knock out. You will become our new poly farmer. Okay, die bitch. Let's, let's just check out the stats real quick. Uh, it's not bad. It's 272, man. It could have been worse from what it came. Started out with. Not in the slightest, but enough foreshadowing of the dire base potential, or should I say, premonitions. Guess we'll have to wait and see. Who knows? My tribe mate Jojo had found a base or hidden cave located on Crystal Isles, just underneath the floating islands. It was built in a sneaky fashion, hidden behind some vines, so you wouldn't be able to see it as easily. As for the defenses, it was a single tower filled with some auto turrets, which gave rise to the idea or assumption that the players had not reached level 100 just yet. But that's not what had intrigued us. It was their base, their crafting station. From what it seemed, they were loaded. So we needed to take a look at all of the attacking possibilities. And trust me, I thought of rockets, but they weren't going to work. The tower was built a safe distance away from the ledge. But that wasn't the only ledge that we could have potentially taken advantage of. There was another, just opposite of the base, that we could use to perhaps plan and even make use of. These are, I'm pretty sure, is counted as well. Nope. They're not? Damn. Yeah, take a sleeping bag. I'll split it half. Yeah, right, just, just get your ass in there. Sure. Yeah, grab the sleeping Okay, I'll just put it on your mana. Yeah, I'll put, I'll put my kit on the mana. I made sure to stow away anything that I wouldn't be using. That way if things went south, well, I'd save most of my items. Okay, I'm pretty sure I can just run up on the side and blow that foundry with all the turrets. Not the most complex plan, I know, but that sometimes that's all you ever need. Simplicity. And then to not risk the all, I'm just gonna... Oh, I... Uh, I'd... Yeah. Bro, I'm sitting right on the stars and they're not shooting me. Yeah, because he took out the ammo, I'm pretty sure. In some of them. We made it. A few more C4 and we'd have this base to ourselves. Four turrets down. Nice. We got BPs. Oh, ammo. Holy. Really? We got yeah, rock I'm golem. On that one bag. Hell of a... There's a crowd fridge back here. It's pin coded. But I'm not sure. Cooker? A cooker? That's no way! That's huge! One of the more expensive advanced structures when it comes to it. Not oh bad. Oh my god. Oh, come on! Yo, look at this one, look at this one! Yeah, I see that. Oh my god. More ammo. Holy. 
And electronics. My blood stock has 1.5k weight. I'll take all the electronics. This is such insane profit. More profit than yesterday's raid. And yesterday's raid required so much more than what today's did. Let me get this blood stock out. This is my weight stock as well. So if you want to toss anything weight wise. Oh my god, such good ARB farm. Rest in peace. I can't even take all this gunpowder. Oh. Oh, that's because I have metal on me. That it took. We don't need the metal. Oh, but so much gunpowder, bro. Cloth flat. Oh my god, look at all these narcotics. I'm taking all these easy mid boosts for the boys. Here's oh. your honey for your bear if you need it. Oh, no, I already taking the bear, bro. Nice. Yeah, no, it's not, it's not, it's oh, nice. Oh, no, that's not even a lot. Okay, so. Did you get all the gunpowder? I got all the gunpowder and the cloth plate and all the LB. Oh, okay, yeah. That's not stressed about the metal. I just was yeah. thinking if we're gonna overweight ourselves with the gunpowder. Oh, I see, I see. Okay. Oh, my God. Such easy raids. Such and easy this, look at the, the stage of that base. It's such Bob kind of base. Yeah, but so profitable. Indeed, it was extremely profitable and extremely easy to raid. Unfortunately, the players had gotten out with the cryos, but we, we got out with all the hard farmed resources and transferring out would be a piece of cake, especially seeing as the transfer timer was on our side. All we had to do was basically do a bit of a popcorning and we'll be sorted. But if all you clocked was a glimpse, well then here's a tad bit longer for ya. Okay, Jojo, look inside the rep. I'm gonna put all the insane prof in the rep. That's all the gunpowder. I'm gonna toss all the ARB as well. Can I move? I still can't move. How much do I weigh? Toss out those narcotics and cliff platform and you'll be a okay. But if you do remember, we had tamed the dire bear at the very beginning, and it was for one reason and one reason alone to simply farm the polymer plants over in the aberration radiation zone, but you don't necessarily get radiation over in that area. So I headed over to aberration to farm the polymer plant. And instead of initially getting polymer, I had found this instead. Okay, guys, so I just got here and what? Oh my. That's insane. That's actually insane. Oh, 1k due to flak. A transmitter with some good flak, some tech armor, and even what seemed to be a thoroughbred dire bear. Damn, people in small tribes really do be leaving just anything in these freaky transmitters. Do a 4c4, I can blow this up. In here would be the gen, in here would just be the bed. Potential is lies within here. Okay, this is just someone's bed, and then that's most likely the generator that powered that. Nothing inside, but I can't complain. I just got some tech armor, really good flak, and even what seemed to be a really thoroughbred dire bear. Let's get that poly. Now we can grab some poly. Oh, it also looks cool. No ways. It's actually a line. Oh, that's actually so easy. Oh, damn, we slot capped. I guess that's as much as we'll be able to carry then. How much weight is a slot cap? 1.7. So my blood stock won't be able to carry all of that. Well, I guess that's all of the polymer. Not bad. We got a couple gifts along the way. I'd take it. Best believe I headed straight back over to base and deposited all of the polymer. Yeah, after I decided I'd head over to Crystal Isles, I'm sure you can guess the underground of the floating islands. If that base was there, so easy to raid, perhaps on any of the other servers would be the same. But instead, I found uh, this guy. They have good gear, bro. Like, we might might actually be worth for us to go over there and PvP him a little to try and kill him a couple of times to get to Because I can... I don't can't guarantee... Oh, I picked I... him! He tossed out a mantis! I'm killing him. He's dropping down. I saw they from shards. It was me, him, and the owl in the air. I'd have to take him out before he gets on that owl, otherwise I wouldn't have another opportunity. Kill him! Just kill him just before he got back or got on his uh on his snow. I just got a whole kit to kill this mantis. Oh my god, cap pump! Is that made by them? Uh, crafter one, two, three. I don't know if I can kill the snarl. I'll try. Oh my god, I killed him mid-air, bro, with the blood stalker. Yeah. 
Wait, can I pick a snarl? Wait, yeah. no way. Yeah, you can. Well, maybe I need to be a bit closer. No, I don't. No, I don't think you can. No, it's not giving the option to. Is it not? No, it's not. I thought it was, but no. I just... such a small team, though. Yeah, I know. I'm just wiping out of the blood stalker now. I'm right underneath it. Oh, it's almost it's getting bloody. I see a hole in its wing. Kill the snarl. Journeyman snarl saddle. He was farming flint, bro. Don't... I just profited so much flint. My blood stalker is just underneath uh, being encumbered. My blood stalker was just below the encumbered threshold, allowing me to swoop around and carry all of the flint. We got a free flint farm, not to forget to mention a really nice pump, saddles, so we'll go a pretty long, long way and save us a lot of time when it comes to farming. But this is where I'm going to be ending today's video, make sure to check out my discord, link to that in the description below so you never miss out on any of my uploads or future announcements. Along with that, if you have been missing any of the episodes in the series, then make sure to check out any of the videos on screen so you get a better idea of the progression and the story behind the entire series. Other than that, I hope you guys did go on to enjoy and if you did, do be sure to leave a like and subscribe, it really helps me out and goes a long way. Other than that, I hope you're going to have a great rest of your day and until next time, you know what it is, say it with me, this has been your boy Sinzar, signing out, peace.